show you how to uh, change your host file, and that's to point a website to a new server. This is a, usually useful when you're using a, a, any type of migration or something, when you're going through that. So the website we're going to use is uh, loontech.com. Uh, and we're going to point this domain to another uh, URL. So uh, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up our Finder, and I already have it open. And we're going to go to right here. We're going to say Go to Folder. And I already have it typed in, uh, but you can actually type this in manually. You just do Private. You hit Tab. So simple like that. Uh, private etc and host and it'll actually highlight the host file for you uh, what we want to do is because this file is protected you need to drag it out to a non-protected place so I like to put it in my uh, desktop and now we're going to open this it doesn't matter where you open it and what file editor uh, but I uh, just text edit is by default and what you're going to do is you're going to type in the IP address uh, that you're pointing to. In this case, this is a new EC2 instance. And you're going to type the domain name. Um, I like to put www and also the regular uh, domain name as well, uh, just to be safe. Uh, but you should just, you only need one, whatever one you're using. If you're not using www, you don't need it. Um, in between here, it is a tab. So if you're typing this out, just hit the tab key and you're good to go. When you're done, I just do a command S to save it. We can close this out and we're going to drag it back in here. And because this is a private area, you need to authenticate it. So I'm going to authenticate it, hit move. We're going to replace it. And you can either use your password if you have the uh, the new fingerprint scanner, it does that too. And when I change that, I refresh this, it'll do this. Oh, it should. Let's try clearing our cache. Let's type this in again. This could be an SSL issue. There we go, the new website. So if it doesn't work uh, completely right, uh, you will have to clear your uh, cache with your browser um, or with your terminal. And that's a, a little bit, uh, it's a different issue. And if you have that issue, just let me know. Uh, have a good day.